Sometimes, like, even doing these, like, kind of let's plays of... Uh, you can talk about whatever, you know? It's like the old days of watching scene and it's just talking about, I don't know, you yeah. play Call of Duty and you'd listen to them talking about eat, drinking wine and cooking chicken. And when I look back, I'm like, why the f*** did I listen to that all day? <laughs> you know, some of <laughs> those kind of commentaries now is uh, Schlatt. He's got a, like a little, and he plays like Modern Warfare 2 footage while he's doing it. So it feels like super old school and I like it. I, I actually watch huh. them all and I comment and everything like... Like oh, Schlatt, being, oh, yeah. Schlatt, notice me, he said oh, he would, Schlatt. he said, he said, oh, he said, he said, he said, he said, he said in Clash Royale, he would, he would react uh, huh? with us, so. And did he? I've known him for a good while. React to that, you fucking hairy fucker. <laughs> <laughs> I was on Twitter one night, and then uh, I got the tweet from, from old school YouTuber Dahi De Nogla, part of the Vanos crew, uh, an old gamer. Uh, part of the part of that that whole group of people that were huge on YouTube like ten years ago, um, and he's like, "Hey man, any any mutuals looking to go to the UFC fight?" And uh, I had just recently gotten into UFC, um, and I was planning on hosting some some friends to to watch this fight. And uh, when I got the when I saw the tweet from Dahi, it was up for like twenty seconds, and I was already in his DMs. And uh, I'd never spoken to the fucking dude in my life, but I knew I had to go. Well, you guys, you guys were mutual, so at this point, right? Yeah, I mean, we followed each other, but uh, I'd never spoken to the dude at all. And uh, that was the that was the intro. And so, you know, he got us a ticket, and then I'm like, "Hey, uh, can I bring a buddy?" And then he's like, "Yeah." And then he bought Ted a ticket. Yeah, he and then I bought flew me a over. Ticket. Yeah, he's fucking. He's such a cool it dude. Was, it was he's incredibly really cool. generous. He was super fun to talk to. Like he was yeah. great. He was. He's awesome. so into UFC too. So like he was giving us insight on the fight because we got great seats too. Dude, this was a fight okay. in Anaheim uh, against the the two hugest people you'll ever see. Yeah. Well, we yeah. I mean, so the the seats that we got was like online relationships are great. Real life relationships are great. There are unique advantages to each one of them. I don't really see like what even the argument is about. Can I say something here, Asman? Online that. relationships are fucking right. shit. They're fucking shit. Yeah, everybody they, would agree. With that. Yeah. I, I, especially if it's with a significant partner. Like, a friends I, are easier online relationships to maintain. But with a significant yeah. partner, it is shit. It is actually dog shit. It is like you could have a five course meal. Well, you're just settling for fucking Cheerios in a box like Schlatt. You know what I mean? Fuck you, bro. <laughs> What's the thing with Cheerios? It's, it's a good terrible. Good it is terrible. Lucky well, Cheerios. Better. So Online my relationships with a yeah, significant yeah. other. Apples to oranges. Talking. All right, this is an argument. I'll get. I'll. I'll, I'll hop on board. Let's go, Slatt. 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 let it's way better because it's loaded up with a bunch of preservatives and sugar. It's, it's just so much better. Yeah, I'm gonna say, there, of course it is. I'm gonna say there is a time and place for that type of Cheerio. <laughs> All I'm there. saying is okay. you can stay you more interested with a five course meal ever, than a box of Cheerios every day. Cheerios with your hand on a podcast. You can't. I, I've eaten a lot yeah, more Cheerios than five course meals. All right, fuck the Cheerios. <laughs> well, I'm gonna ask you. I'm gonna ask you a question that the last oh, two have. days, um, fermented foods, miso soup, yogurt, mm, miso soup, uh, the kefir, whatever it is. Yeah, I know what you're talking about. I went to a ramen place yesterday with. Ted and uh, Dahi De Nogla. Oh, no way. And uh, they played elevator music. That, like the elevator music one hour video on YouTube. It's fucking horrible. Why do, 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 do. Yeah, I, I don't know. I think they were fucking with us.